Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're doing the closeout for the second week of January and opening up the third week. So without further ado, let's go. So as usual, we're gonna start with the expenses. I realized that I didn't calculate the total expenses last week, which was fun, but I did off camera. So let's start. We had five for gas, 31, 34 for groceries, 930 for spending, 7322 for dine out, 8060 for health, 88.42 for clothing, 2240 for miscellaneous, 112 for utilities. I realized that I've been stuffing kind of 25 euros per week, which is like 100 euros per month for utilities. But in the winter time, they're going to be higher. In the summertime, they're going to be lower. So it kind of evens out. So I don't think I'm going to adjust the utility amount, but I might. And if I do, I'm going to let you know. And then beauty is going to get to uh, what got 200 and then upkeep was 25. So in total, it was 604. 46 euros and 40 cents this week quite a, a big spending week but i did have a huge chunk going into beauty also uh utilities so let's go back and update the actual amounts we had and we'll see okay so we had 750 as the actual um uh, what is it called Income, Jesus, I was like, what is happening? I am filming this very early in the morning, not fully woke, uh, wake, woke, <laughs> fully uh, waking up. What is it called? I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, never mind. Uh, let me check quickly the rollover amounts. So I feel like I might leave these amounts in my envelopes because next week when I come back, I put some less money in my envelopes for cash envelopes because I'm leaving on a trip. So I think I'm just gonna leave these here. And then after next week, if we have anything left over, I'm gonna then uh, put it in my savings box. But for now, we have um, 13 in groceries. I'm just thinking, how am I gonna... Okay, I'm gonna put 45. Um, and then the 13 I'm gonna put into rollover like here. Yes, okay, I'm gonna do that. Let me just take this away, it's pissing me off. Okay, I'm gonna do rollover like this. And then groceries is gonna be here and it's gonna be 13. Okay, and then we have spending that has a rollover of 16. Spending. And I know was going to be last. That's going to be 16. And here I'm going to have a 2. So that's a rollover of 2. So that's 2. Okay, so that means we had 16 in spending. 25 minus 16. We spent 9. And 75 minus 2. We spent 73. Okay, so here all of the rest stay the same for all the other categories. So let's see how much we have in um, short-term singing fund. Not sh oh my God, sorry, I'm just literally out of it. A cash envelopes and bills. 750 minus 259, 491 is left. And then here, 491, 40, 10, 5, 30 in clothing, 40 in health, 100 in travel, so 225, and then we have 491 minus 225, 266. 266 bringing down, we have 520, 25, 30 in emergency, 5 in pets, 45 in retirement, 15 technology, and 5 in weddings, that was 150, and then 266 minus 150 is 116. Okay, so we did stuff, uh, 85 in the savings, and that means 80, uh, 13 plus 16 plus 2, 13 plus 16 plus 2 is 31. Okay, so 85 plus 31 should be 116 indeed, which means we have zero euros left to budget, which means that each euro of our income has a place to go into our budget. Let's set up next week's uh, budget, and I'm going to tell you 
uh, what's happening. So I'm also going to be stuffing this paycheck. I'm gonna film this video in advance because during this date I am away on my trip. So I'll probably not film uh, the budget setup for it. Uh, or maybe I might in this video. Okay, we'll see. Uh, so we are going to have an income of 750 and then the rollover amount of, how much was it? 31. So in total that's 781 and we're going to have 45 go no 25 sorry because it's going to be different amounts 25 plus the rollover that we had which is 13 which is 39 in total 25 plus 13 38 sorry 38 um then spending is going to get 10 plus the 16 it had rolled over so that was 26 and then dine out is going to get 30 plus the two that was rolled over so 32 in total perfect so we're stuffing 10 into gas uh, 5 into miscellaneous and then 135 in upkeep so in total 38 26 32 10 5 and 135 246 in cash envelopes and bills so 781 minus 246 535 left to work with really that much yes okay so 535 and then beauty let me check my computer i have my notes here so beauty is going to get 50 birthdays and christmas each at 10 Clothing is going to get 25 and health is going to get a 50. Uh, subscriptions are going to get a five and travel is going to get 135. And in total, that's 285 in short term sinking funds. 535 minus 285 is 250 left to work with. So long term sinking funds, we are stuffing five in babies. 20 in car deposit is going to get 25 as usual emergency is going to get 40 pets 5 retirement 45 technology 5 and weddings 5 so 25 plus 50 plus 10 is 150 so that has 100 left to work with and all of that 100 is going into our savings box for three three thousand euros and that means we have zero euros left to budget which means each year of our income has a place to go into our budget okay so i will probably set up the 27th uh cash uh stuffing as well because i'm going to stuff it anyway so it's going to be 850 euros to work with i'm going to set rollover as zero because i don't know if i'm going to have any left over from this week so i'm just gonna treat it as a zero groceries is going to get 55 on that date 25 into spending and 75 into dine out 10 into gas 5 into miscellaneous and 135 into upkeep so in total that's going to be 305 in bills and cash envelopes so 850 minus 305 is 545 that's what we have working with for the short-term sinking funds so short-term sinking funds 30 into beauty 10 into birthdays then into christmas and then into clothing and then health is going to get 50 holidays five and travel 150 so in total that's going to be 265 545 minus 265 is 280 so for long-term sinking funds we're gonna put five into babies 20 into car 25 in deposit 15 emergency five in pets retirement is going to get 50 technology 10 and weddings five so in total that's going to be 170 and then 280 minus 170 we have 110 left to work with and all of that is going to go into our savings box 
So that means zero euros left to budget, which means each euro of our income has a place to go into our budget. So that was me setting up week uh, three and week four of January. And I'm going to be back tomorrow with a cash stuffing of week three. And then I'm going to also pre-record the video for a cash stuffing of week four four so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a like and consider subscribing to my channel we have fun over here once again sorry i'm so out of it it's literally like 6 a.m and i'm still half asleep so that's fun uh no to future self don't film videos at 6 a.m but yes i really hope you have an amazing day morning evening weekend or whatever and i hope to see you in the next video bye